Hello, my name is Jenna Thomas. This is the I Love channel. I'm a life coach and also career coach. If this is your first time here, welcome to the channel. Please give the like, leave your comments at the end of the video and share this video with your family and with your friends. And in today's video, I want to talk about self-control. Do you think you have self-control? Do you want to get high performance in your life? Stay tuned. What self-control has to do with success? If you didn't watch the last video, I'll let it appear for you what is success. And this video is almost a sequence of the last video, and I will explain. There is a psychology experiment called the Marshmallow Experiment. This experiment is from the 1960s. Walter Michel was the psychologist who made this experiment. And what did it consist? Walter Michel took a group of children, a group of four-year children, and let them separated in their room, one by one. And what the experiment was about? Those children were supposed to stay 15 minutes in this room alone, with this marshmallow in front of them. And the teacher said, if they didn't eat the marshmallow, they would get another one in 15 minutes. And if they ate it, they wouldn't get another one. So they left the room, the teachers left the room, and left the children alone. Some of them started leaking the marshmallow instead of eating. They were smelling the marshmallow. Some of them made it like a hole at the bottom of the marshmallow for nobody to see that there was this hole. And some of them, one in three, one in three, is good, one in three, didn't eat the marshmallow. And why? There is an explanation for that, that is self-control. Those who could resist the temptation they got the second marshmallow. And those who were unable to delay the gratification, they didn't get the marshmallow. 12 years later, the same psychologist, Walter Michel, he followed the same children and what he figured out. Those who couldn't resist the temptation, they were more frustrated in life, disorganized, indecisive, and those who didn't eat the marshmallow, those who could delay the gratification, they were more confident, and they were higher set scores. And the question that I have for you is, which one of these children are you? The marshmallow eater in 15 minutes, the one who was waiting for the second one. Okay, Juliana, actually, I guess I, I'm the one who ate the marshmallow. But now I'm an adult and I have bad results in my life. I'm insecure, I'm very stressed. What can I do? With the same experiment again? Yeah. But not with the marshmallow. You can do with the real life. You can take something that is almost an addiction for you, or even an addiction, like smoking, shopping a lot, eating a lot, and you can create a strategy for not to do that again. What can you do when you go for shopping and you, I know, and I'm gonna enter that store and I'm gonna buy all the shoes because I love shoes and I would spend all my money on these shoes. What can you do to not get into that store? 
you have to create a strategy. I'll leave another card here about the action plan for you. Watch this video. If you need any help, just leave in the comments. I'll help you to create this strategy, to create your action plan. What can I do? I can't quit smoking. What can I do? As you know, if you didn't see my first videos, I think I'll add another one about the coaching for you. About coaching. What is coaching? Where I explain about the, the beliefs. Everything starts with the communication. If I communicate something, I'll think and I'll feel and I'll change my belief. If I communicate shopping impulsively, and if I spend all my money impulsively, what can I do? I have to change my communication. What can I do right now to change your communication? I don't know. Write it down. Take a piece of paper right now. Write it down. Okay, from now on, when I think about going shopping, what will I do? What will I communicate different? Write down a strategy that can change your attitudes, physical attitudes. Those attitudes will change your hormones, your testosterone. They will move you, they will put you in action. Start, start today. Take this piece of paper and write it down. It, I'm sure it will help you. So don't be the marshmallow eater. Resist. Delay the gratification. Learn how to do it. You don't have to be that kid. You can be an adult who's, who's capable to change your future. Don't be a victim of yourself of your actions, of your bad actions, of your past actions. Write down your life story. Write down. You can change your future, but depends only on you. I cannot do that for you, unfortunately. You have to do it for yourself, and I'm sure you can do it. I trust you, and I know you can do it. I'll see you on our next video. Take care. Thank you very much.